Okay, what I'm going to be doing is showing you how to replace a battery and a key fob for a Ducati motorcycle. Uh, this one specifically is off of my 2011 uh, Ducati Multistrada. Uh, the first thing I would do is go to any kind of automotive store and buy, I, I'm sure it's probably the same for all of them, but the battery that's in there is actually a CR 2032. Uh, this one happens to be an Energizer. Uh, it was, I think it was like four dollars or so. Uh, but they come individually. Um, so anyway, so I've got a CR2032. Took it out of the package already. And the only other things you're going to need are a quarter and a small flathead screwdriver. You could probably use a, a large screwdriver flathead for the, the part that the quarter is being used for. But Basically you open your key and what you're going to want to do is right in this portion here you're going to take your quarter put it right where the key goes in and you're going to turn it and you hear that pop that's the casing around so what you're going to do is work your way around to open that casing and it'll take a second because I don't want to break anything so you can see I kind of got it cracked open so we'll pull it the rest of the way and what you're going to see is the one side there's nothing in there and the other side you have the battery and the small uh, transmitter but it stays in there and you can't get the battery out so what you need to do is you actually take your small flathead screwdriver you go in underneath the battery and there's two small clips that keep this piece in but if you go right below the battery and just give it a little pop. Be careful not to break the circuit board. I'm going to give it a little pop. Pops out. Now you have the circuit board out. All you're going to do is take your flathead screwdriver, slide the battery out like that, grab your new one, make sure it's facing the right direction, push it back in. And then what you're going to do is you're actually going to take the battery end and set it in to the casing just how it was. So what you're going to do is you're going to place the circuit board in there. Even though it looks like it's placed, it still moves around. You're actually going to push on this white transmitter here until you hear a click. And now it's in. So then what you're going to do, you're going to keep your key open just like that. You're going to take your plastic piece, line it up, and then simply work your way around it, snapping it back into place, and then close your key, open it, make sure your circuit board and everything is in there uh, nice and tight, and that's it. Easy squeezy.